What's up guys? Today I'll be doing a review of the American Fist Reflex Ball. So stay tuned. Uber up the styles like miles and shit. Like 60s funky worms with waves and perms. Just sending junky rhythms right. Okay guys, so the first ball I'm using is the newbie ball. This is the easiest out of the four. It has a nice rebound to it. It's really consistent. It has an elastic cord that's connected to this uh, pretty lightweight foam ball. As you can see, I'm having a pretty easy time doing this, keeping a rhythm. Um, it comes back pretty easy, and it's a, the, probably the best ball to begin with. Uh, the second one right here is going to be the veteran ball. This is actually a blue tennis ball, so it has a harder consistency when you hit it with your hand. Um, it has a thicker elastic cord, so it rebounds a little, a little bit faster, so you just have to get used to the timing of it coming in a little bit quicker. Um, but again, it has a harder consistency, and you can see I'm, I'm having... A pretty decent time using that. The third one is going to be the boxer ball. I found this one to be actually the hardest. Um, it's supposed to be um, a little bit more erratic and you can see I'm having a hard time just with my hand and eye coordination trying to time it. It's bouncing all over the place. So definitely the hardest one. And then lastly, is this is going to be beast mode. This is going to be a hard rubber ball. It has a lot of weight to it, about a pound. Um, as you can see, the, it has a lot of weight, so it rebounds actually a little bit slower. I didn't find this one to be as hard as the boxer ball because of the weight. I would cut the cord a little bit shorter. Hey, what's up guys? Carlo here, and today I'll be doing a review of the American Fist Ultimate Reflex Ball Set. I'm going to give a shout out to my friends over at American Fist for sending me this ball. And this is a Amazon exclusive reflex ball set that you can get for $16.97. So... 17 bucks, and you get one of the best, if not the best bang for the buck reflex balls that you can currently get on the market. Um, if you're an Amazon Prime member, you can get it for free. The shipping is really fast. You probably can get it the same day or next day, uh, just depending on which shipping option you choose. But for 17 bucks, um, if you guys watched the previous reflex ball review I did of the Tech XYZ ball last year, to me, this is leaps and bounds better than that. And it's only about four or five dollars more than the Tech XYZ ball. But the overall build quality and just everything that's included with this kit um, is really nice. So the first thing that's included obviously is the carrying package that um, has the American Fist logo on it. Nothing really too crazy about this. It's a plastic package. It does come with a felt carrying case with a uh, drawstring up top with the American Fist logo that is screen printed on the felt bag. So this is a nice carrying case. Um, it does come included with 180 inch hand wraps. These are just red basic hand wraps that you can use. So that's a nice added touch. Um, here's the centerpiece of the reflex ball in my opinion is this headband. Um, it's a really nice high quality elastic headband with the D-ring loop up top here on your forehead. And you can see that it has this American fist that is stitched on here. And then it has a Velcro closure so that it's fully adjustable depending on how big your head is and then the inside has this rubberized uh, material that is for gripping so once you put this on your forehead or if you're using a, a hat it does a really nice job of staying staying in place and not moving around and then you have this d-ring closure right here so i really like the quality of this it feels really nice really soft um, i like the little details obviously the velcro and i like how they roll the edges over on that so just little touches like that little details that you typically wouldn't find with something that's as cheap as this. And then you have the American Fist Smasher Limits user manual uh, inside here. Basically just shows you, you know, how to cut the length of each reflex ball. It comes with the elastic cord for each one. One thing to keep in mind is if you're gonna trim it to your size, you gotta keep in mind if, that if you're the only one using it, then that's okay to do. You wanna trim it from your shoulder down to where your knuckle is. But if you're gonna have multiple people using this reflex ball kit, then I would give yourself a little extra length just in case someone has longer arms than you and want to use this reflex ball. Um, and so it basically just shows you how to um, thread the um, string into the lobster locks. So you can see each one has a lobster lock that it comes with, which latches onto that D-ring. Um, and then over here, it shows you the kind of ball. So it comes with four different balls. The black is gonna be the newbie ball. The blue is the veteran, the foam red is boxer, and this solid red right here is called beast mode. So I'll go over about detailing how that how those work. And then right here it just shows you how to wrap your hands. Uh, pretty basic and generic right there. So the balls themselves, you have starting off the newbie. So this ball is the easiest one to use in my opinion. 
It's called the Newbie for a reason. It's a soft foam material and it has a pretty thin elastic cord. Again, it's really nice because you can use this lobster lock like I showed you in the video of me hitting it and it just quickly attaches to that D-ring. So switching them out is really quick and painless. You can also see what I did is I cut the end off. I'm primarily the one using this, but I just cut it off and then I run the elastic string through the lobster lock. Um, but this is the easiest one to use. It's the most consistent. Um, it has a good bounce and, and rebound to it. So really good for beginners. The next one is going to be the Veteran, which is a basically it's a blue tennis ball. Um, it feels just like the tennis ball. It has that felt on the outside. It has the same consistency as a tennis ball. So it's a little heavier. And you can also see that the elastic cord on this one is also thicker. So it rebounds a little faster. Um, but this is one this one I found to be pretty good to use as well It's a little more difficult than this one to, to maintain rhythm um, Then you have this boxer one now this one right here is called beast mode But in my opinion this boxer one is the hardest one to use um, This is again a foam ball has you know pretty firm consistency a little bit thicker cord But I found with this one based on just the the weight of it and the kind of cord that's being used this elastic cord this one moves the most erratically, the most random. So you, you have a hard time timing this one and using your hand-eye coordination because of, of how erratic uh, this ball moves. And then beast mode, um, again, this one has a pretty thick elastic cord, but this ball is a solid rubber ball. So it actually has a good amount of weight to it. I would say maybe about a pound. Uh, it weighs about a pound, maybe a little bit more than that, but it's a pretty heavy ball uh, and it has this elastic I didn't find this one to be too hard. This one actually rebounds slower because the weight and the mass of this rubber ball is much more denser. So when it bounces back and forth, it doesn't it doesn't rebound as fast unless you hit it really hard in order for this to rebound. So this one again is called beast mode and doesn't rebound in my opinion as fast as the other just because of the weight of this ball. So all in all, you can see here, it's a really nice kit. I like the presentation. They, you know, they, they include a lot of accessories. You have the bag, the carrying case, the headband, the hand wraps, the four balls, the lobster locks, as well as the elastic cords, and then these user manual. For, for, so for 17 bucks with free shipping, it's a really good deal. Um, I know Rival and Tidal also make their own version of a reflex ball that's more expensive than this, plus shipping. So for everything that you're getting here, uh, especially the headband and, and the four different variety of balls, it's really hard to beat this. So if you guys have any comments or questions, make sure you guys leave them down below in the comments box. I'll put the link in the description box where you can get this reflex ball. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.